Okay, this is um, jogless stripes. Uh, I'm going to do a um, black garter band here to match what I've got on the back of the neck. See, I have a black garter band on the back of the neck. So I'm going to do um, I'm going to do a black garter band here. But you can see I'm ending. I'm I'm using up this yarn. I'm ending kind of like in an awkward place. So I don't want to start my black here. I'm going to start my black over under the underarm. But I'm going to end in my pink here. So glasses are going to help a lot. Okay, so here is the 411. I'm going to put my needle in the stitch below. See, I'm in the stitch below. I'm going to catch that yarn and I'm going to bring it to the front. Now, I want you to notice I, I do not have a cross at the end of that. I've got the yarn comes in, it goes over the loop, and it goes out. So this I'm going to put over the top of this stitch like that and I'm going to snug it down so that the loop can you see the pink loop is below the the silvery gray one so that's gone now I'm going to scooch all the way to the underarm I'm going to put all of those stitches on this needle so that I can start my black under the arm all right here I am I am ready to start this row and I'm I'm doing my the start of my row under the arm. You can put your the start wherever it's convenient for you, center back, whatever, it doesn't matter. I'm going to knit all the way around and come back to here. I'm I'm purposely wrapping my yarn around my needle so that when I come back to these stitches the leading leg is in the back. That's the way I like it. I didn't <clears throat> excuse me, continental combine mirrored and um, so I'll come back to here and I'll show you how this is done. Okay, so here we are. I'm almost back to where I started. I need to put my the tip of my needle in there, but the easy way to do it is to take your tail and pull your tail a little bit and it opens up that stitch. See how it opens up that stitch? Hopefully I can. So I'm going to do exactly the same thing. I'm going to grab a loop and I'm going to put it over the top of this stitch and pull it down behind the, behind the pearl bump and knit off. And that's really all there is to it. There's, it just it hides the end so well. Let me take you back to the front and show you. You can't tell where I ended the, the pink stripe. Okay. I ended the pink stripe right there somewhere. Can you see where I ended it? I can't. I would have to look very, very carefully. So, that's all there is to it. Pretty simple.